Steve Jobs. Yeah. So, <laughs> uh, try to think about five to eight, uh, like five most cases, and eight if you have very bad luck. And what is going to happen? Uh, let's see. Can I share my screen? Yeah. Uh, how do I do it? Oh, one second. All right. Okay, let's see. Where, where is the, the option to share the screen? Oh. Um, um, all right. Try that. Oh, okay. try that. There it is. <laughs> One second. I'm going to plug in my computer. Okay. 95, baby. Oh, wow, you're at 75 an hour? Yeah, I put it there. <laughs> but uh, again, this is like, uh, this is rarely respected, so. Really? Yeah. Anyways. Uh, is, it good to is it good to have it up, right? Yeah, definitely, because when people look for freelancers, uh, they are going to, uh, let's say I want to look for the top freelancers right. in Upwork work uh, to do something. Uh, and this is something that I did when I got my accountant. I immediately went for the people who were asking uh, prices above uh, sixty dollars per hour, because I was looking uh, for an accountant that was at least a uh, hundred dollars per hour. So in those cases, that is that is where it really matters. Anyways, the thing with Upwork is that many people will judge you because of this number. Right. And in the beginning, you won't get it, <laughs> uh, which it sucks. So the first, to get this number, and uh, this takes a little bit uh, to get updated. So for example, even if you get your first videos right now, and they all have five stars, uh, it's going to take maybe a, a day or two days a month uh, to get uh, for the success uh, rate to appear. So, the first steps that you have to take uh, are pretty much in order to get this. <laughs> and to get this, you have to get, like the best case that I have seen was a friend of mine who got it with four jobs, but, it's, but most people get it at five. And the uh, bad luck ones get it at eight. <laughs> so it's like an algorithm that they have, so pretty much. So four, so four to eight jobs. Yeah. Uh, so pretty much aim for five. Uh, five is the, where most people get it. So something that you can do is that if you know already a couple of clients who can you can do like a very quick kind of job, like uh, let's say somebody wants to launch a podcast and you want to create a visual, like the logo for their podcast, you can offer them like, hey, I can do your logo for the podcast for uh, $50 or something like that, which let me show you. Here. Right. That was pretty much what we did in the beginning. We started like offering our friends, uh, hey, you know what? I, I can do your intro for YouTube video for $50 or your logo animated for $50. And we got like uh, a couple of those. And that's how we got the reviews really fast. So in the beginning, pretty much it was like that, like uh, so finding friends of ours who we knew that they had uh, profiles in Upwork. And we told them like, hey, I can do this for you for fifty dollars, and just leave me like a really great review in Upwork, and I'll be right. happy, right? Got so it. that's what we did. So that is a trick that you can use to to get it really fast. Got it. So quick and quick and easy jobs with friends. Yeah, and also uh, when you get uh, two or three jobs done, and you get like five stars. You might get selected uh, to appear like a rising star. Uh, let me. See okay. Here. So it's just. <laughs> so you're just like a savage beast. <laughs> 
So pretty much something, but in order for Upwork to give you like the, uh, let me see if there is. Yeah, and I need to I need to start using this platform too for the marketplace, right? Yeah, pretty much. So, uh, something that you can have. Uh, okay, so there it is, rising talent. So once you get like. Uh, two or three jobs that have like uh, uh, five stars, you can get this title of raising talent. But in order to get it, you have to have your profile completely at 100%. So this guy has four jobs done. Uh, here they are. Uh, these two are in progress. So he just got two reviews right now. And because of that, he got this. Okay. Uh, Great. So uh, this is going to obviously help you get a little bit more jobs in the beginning. But then uh, pretty much what happens is that uh, you get the you get the, the success rate here in the, in the corner and it will get replaced. So try to keep it up uh, above 90% obviously because that's where most people are looking for. And to get the top rated, uh, you will have to get like $1,000 or more in less than, uh, I think it was uh, three months maximum in the last three months. So obviously if you get the $1,000 uh, faster than that, you can get this faster. But it has to be above uh, $1,000. And again, you have to have your whole uh, profile completed and the upward readiness test pass as well. Got it. All right. So well, I think it was. Do you do you need like how about this? We'll do like a landing page for you for like cheap is cheap. Like what? Hundred hundred bucks, two hundred bucks. I don't care. We'll do it. <laughs> Can you give me a good review? <laughs> <laughs> uh, cool, but definitely I don't have anything right now that yeah. I can use. Yeah, no, but how do you find out who's friends on the platform? Well, I have like a, a I'm in a group of Facebook uh, from a mastermind that I joined like, uh, like, like a long time. So I knew that all people there had Upwork profiles because they are hiring there. So I just went like, hey, I'm offering like this logo, <laughs> uh, animated logos for YouTube channels or whatever if you want to use it for $50. And, and this is what I want to do. So I just posted it there and we got it really fast. Perfect. And I just posted as well, like uh, I'm just doing this for the first four people. So <laughs> adding right. a little bit of uh, scarcity there. <laughs> oh, so you said the first how many people? The first four people, <laughs> but I took five. <laughs> Perfect. All right, awesome. Sorry, yes, keep going. So pretty much that's uh, that's what we did to get the uh, to get the first uh, five reviews as fast as possible, and the top rated again. Uh, you will have to wait uh, maybe three months or so uh, in order to get it. Uh, the profile has to be like 100% complete. You have to have the upward readiness test pass. Uh, you all your success rate has to be above uh, 90%. And you have to have uh, above that one thousand dollars. But once you get the success rate, like if it is above, if you get like one hundred percent success rate, and and if you do this tactic, like you will get it. Uh, you can start applying for jobs really fast uh, as well. And something that I did is that, uh, for example, uh, I created these filters and so pretty much. You can see here, uh, I can put here uh, fixed price, uh, numbers of proposals, uh, uh, less than 10, because if, the, if it is more than 10, especially if you don't have the top rated, uh, it's not going to be worth it to apply to those. Once you have the top rated, uh, you will get selected in the like even if you apply late, you are going to be one of the top positions. So that is something good to know. So, uh, but I like to keep it less than 10 proposal sent. Uh, 
uh, here's the budget, uh, any client history, any experience level, uh, payment verified, this is very important. <laughs> uh, if you see a client that doesn't have like a, a verified payment, uh, I would suggest not to apply. <laughs> yeah, okay. So you can start looking here for the uh, for the jobs. Obviously, you can add more filters to it. So I selected here the category animation. You can select here the categories that you want uh, for the type of query that you're looking for. Sorry. And here you can save save search. So so that way you can have it. Uh, right. Here. Right, right, right. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. Um, yeah, so we can target like websites and. Um, okay, so after this, you send a message, uh, right? Sure. Yeah. I already have like a script ready uh, for this. Uh, do you do this, or do you have uh, an assistant do it? Yeah, I have another peop uh, uh, another person do it. I just take uh, right now we are completely uh, a full of work, so I don't uh, I haven't been posting, but right. different projects. But uh, for example, if I want to apply to this one, let's say uh, here it is. Uh, there is not much details. Uh, awesome, fourteen k. That's great. Yeah. So I can click here, just submit a proposal. So have you gotten like bigger projects yet? Uh, to be honest, not, not yet. Uh, we got a couple uh, into the end of the interview, but then we got like really full. <laughs> right, right. Especially challenge, so I, I after the challenge, I pretty much ignored this. <laughs> right, and so do they? Do you usually just have a call and then and then they hire you, or what? Uh, usually it's all through chat. Oh, great! So there's no sales calls. Yeah, so there has been two people who have uh, asked for a call. Obviously, when that happens, you will have to to be there, but. But usually it's just this, like. Got it. So I, do you have like project managers answering for you and stuff? Uh, I, I just have a, a friend of mine who is helping me out with this. So, uh, and he's also like a, a, a video editor and, and an animator. So he's the one taking it. Pretty much, he has just the con uh, whole control of this right now. Right, and and so uh, after probably like one or two projects, do you do you like talk to your client about getting off the platform? Uh, right now, to be honest, I haven't talked uh, with any of them to leave the platform. Uh, again, like uh, I started doing this, we got the uh, we got the top rated but at the point we got the top rated was at the same time that I was getting a lot of sales so <laughs> right I, I, I abandoned this right now but I'm planning on taking it back right got it cool and um, and so you just chat with the client through the platform mm-hmm okay and so it's pretty there simple there is also a map for, for it so you can Chat with him. Got it. All right, I'm posting the group now to find out who's on Upwork. <laughs> <laughs> so here is something important as well. You have to be very careful of how do you do this. Uh, how do you take it off the, the platform? Because if you see, it, they have like a, an algorithm. So if they hear, Keywords like email, uh, phone number, PayPal. Uh, I don't remember uh, right. what else, but but they will mark you uh, if they see this. So you can 
if you are not careful, uh, you can get your account banned by, by trying to get off the platform. So you have to to be a little bit sneaky. Man, that's it's like a military operation, huh? Yeah. <laughs> that's not fun. That's why they that that's why people hate Upwork, right? Yep. <laughs> Yeah, they're like, stay safe. Like, like we're grown adults. Are we really going to be in danger when we go off your platform? No. Not only that, like, look at this. Uh, this is something that people hated. And this happened uh, not so long ago. So well, let's say uh, this uh, project that was $14,000, right? Okay, so... Mm -hmm. Look at this, <laughs> and, and how they, and 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 for example, something that happens that pisses people off is that if the client hasn't paid you, let's say five hundred dollars, then they don't charge uh, ten percent; they charge uh, twenty percent. So let's just. Oh, I think they have reduced it. Oh wow! They so they they reduced their percentage. Yeah, <laughs> let me see. Maybe maybe it is detecting that this is like a bigger that a bigger job or something like that. Okay, so this one uh, one hundred and seventy five dollars similar proposal. Let's say. Okay, so if you see in this case, because it was less than five hundred dollars, uh, they are taking even more. <laughs> this is not this is not ten percent. This is twenty percent. And this is and it is here like, uh, if you work uh, with a client and whatever you work with a client uh, is less than five hundred dollars, they take twenty percent. Uh, if it goes above five hundred dollars to ten thousand dollars. Right. Take cent and over ten thousand dollars, five percent. So. Right. But but this one pretty much has fucked up many freelancers because, uh, you know there are many projects where you can do like really easy jobs, uh, easy money, uh, people paying for very simple projects that are below five hundred dollars, and now you're losing twenty percent on that. <laughs> right. Because we have uh, like uh, applied for projects who that were like two hundred dollars, but in reality yeah. we knew that it was only thirty dollars at cost. So, yeah, like, oh, yeah, like this is two hundred. So. Dude, yeah, I, I think yeah, I, I got this down. I I'll just connect the people on LinkedIn or something, and then just chat with them there. Yeah, that that is something that people do as well. Like uh, try to find them. Uh, for example, if you. If they have put the name of their business in, uh, at nine, they look it look it up from Google. Uh, pretty much stalk them, and and when I hire uh, another freelancer, uh, sometimes I get their emails uh, introducing themselves, and, and right. you can take it from there that way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Screw, but, screw you, Upwork. <laughs> but yeah, definitely do not try to do it in this in, in inside the messages. Right, or right. if you do, try to be very careful with the words that you use. Right. So, for example, uh, 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 a nice trick that I was using in the beginning was that I was sending the URL uh, to a real page from my website. So <laughs> now they were when they went, wanted to see the, my reel, I will send the link. And they will be the two reels and all my contact information as well. So that was something I was doing in the beginning. But then they started like uh, tracking up with the algorithm. So if I posted like www.domain.com, they will immediately detect it. So what I did was like uh, pretty much space it a little bit. Or, uh, right. So maybe instead of uh, HTTP, www, I took that out and just put Print Freak Studio space dot space com 
and then the, the rest of the URL, and, and that way they didn't detect it. And I just put it out there like, uh, um, I'm separating this, uh, I'm putting some spaces because somewhere it is, uh, is uh, pretty much blocking this URL or something like that. Right. So that is another way that you can do it. You can have like a mini landing page for the people that they do apply here. Right. You can have all the information there so, so they can contact you uh, from outside of work. Got it. All right, so um, yeah, and, and in your portfolio and stuff, you can link to your site and stuff, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah, definitely. Cool. Awesome. Sweet. So, let's see. Okay. so I did this page pretty much. I think I showed it uh, before to you. And this is not uh, mapped inside any any of these. Uh, so any time they ask about my reels, I could show this to them and they will see the companies and all that. And obviously I have the contact information there. So And, and here it is as well. So awesome. it is a nice trick. <laughs> Your site looks pretty good. Thanks. Yeah. And also, some of these are the same testimonials that I got from Mobwork. So that is a, a, a good thing that you can do as well because. Yeah. You automate that or you just copy paste? No, I had to copy paste it. Uh, that'd be a nice little hack though, right? Automated mm -hmm. reviews. Yeah. Now that you mention it, it might, I might look in, in Sapir. Maybe there is something there. <laughs> I'm sure you could, right? Because I'm sure it sends you an email, and then you could push the email to the website. Yeah, so for example, uh, let's see. Okay, for simple animated icons, uh, we will say, well, I think, yes. Okay, so yeah, so it was this client. Obviously, I just changed my name to Frame Pretty Studio. Right, All right, of course. Awesome. Yeah, you you should get you should start getting some statistics on the videos. That will make that'll make everything more compelling. You know. Yeah, definitely. I try it uh, again, but uh, so far I. I I don't know why my, my clients have been a little bit secretive about their metric. Yeah. I mean, you should just tell them you don't, you won't work with them unless they tell you, because if you really are, if you really want to make sure they grow, then you have to know the numbers, right? Yeah. Yeah. So far, since we have been only production, uh, and we haven't uh, right. offered like the marketing services, I think that that's part of the reason why they they keep it that, that way uh, we may need to change that a little bit and to add like the service for a little bit of promotion right awesome dope well is that is that pretty much it yeah pretty much All that's right. it